They say that London is a man's town. And that Paris is a woman's town. But the place where the sexes get together is Naples. Naples. It started in Naples. Five o'clock in the morning. Five o'clock. A fire time. Naples, that's where all the fireworks begin in this sparkling, sizzling, heartwarming story of a hard-fisted, rich American male, a softly curved Italian female, and their battle over a nine-year-old delinquent street urchin they each want to adopt. You think I want to be like you, Americano, in a pig's eye? Now, wait a minute, wait a minute. You are half American, you know. You don't tell nobody, I don't tell nobody. I got enough trouble. Clark's his uncle on his father's side. <laughs> Sophia's his aunt on his mother's side. Ah, but two prodigals are getting tonight. Vittorio, the lucky lawyer who's always in the middle. Introducing Marietto. The cute kid who will steal your heart and your wallet as he cooks up a big stew between his uncle, who's as American as hamburger, and the aunt, who's as spicy as pizza pie. Karina! You made the as a picture, you're Karina! And yet I'm just an innocent bambina who's grown, but never has known the sweetest game of love. Sophia wants him to go to school. Tomorrow I get the hell out of here. Yes. Clark tries to teach him baseball. And then see what happens when Naples works its magic. And Clark and Sophia start playing games of their own. Yes, it started in Naples. And you'll never guess how far it goes. It started in Naples, the kind of a movie that surprises the world only once in a long, long time. For as you find yourself in the most beautiful place on earth, Capri, you'll get a lift on the most colorful vacation from care you've ever had. When you see It Started in Naples, you too will say it's wonderful.